communities across our region continue to dig out from this weekend snowstorm and the city of Roanoke public works crews are working to make sure streets remain safe for you to drive. With main roads clear, they've been working to make residential streets passable. Ted News reporter Irisha Jones is live in Roanoke. So Irisha, how are they working to do that? Well, public work crews are bringing the snow from downtown Roanoke to this parking lot here at Washington Park. They say they're happy with the progress they've been able to make since Sunday. Public work crews in Roanoke have been busy since five Sunday morning, going nonstop, getting as much snow off the streets as possible. We're about 90% complete with uh, at least making them passable. So today we're going to go back and we're going to widen out areas that we weren't able to get to previously. We're going to go back into some of the dead end streets that we were not able to touch yesterday. They say the sunshine and increasing temperatures help speed up the process. We were concerned about the refreeze last night, but uh, the extent of the ice on the streets did not seem to uh, be as as prevalent as we would have thought. I think yesterday's uh, uh, sunshine really helped to dry a lot of the pavement. Trucks today are still spreading salt and plowing roads. This truck made a route in parking lots and side streets in downtown Roanoke. Bob Bingston says there's more work waiting for crews later this week. Begin to work so that we can get some of the snow moved away from our storm drains because we've got heavy rain coming in later in the week. As a reminder to drivers, Public Works wants you to still be aware for the potential of black ice on the roads. The director also says crews were able to get to some of the steepest streets in the city. Live in Roanoke, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.